encontrado un pajarillo sano. This is not the end. video we are going to play around with a few warm-up exercises for our singing voice. Some of the exercises are quite fun. There are a few that imitate sounds of nature or animals and we are also using the combination of different consonants and vowels to create syllables, creating words or patterns of words that may not necessarily mean anything to our language yet again they are helping us form different shapes with our mouth to warm up the vessel that will carry out all the work so let's begin we start with the lip trill it sounds a little bit like this Try to take a long inhalation and through your exhalation, you're just allowing the lips to vibrate as freely as possible. Try it with me. Relax the muscles around your mouth and really let your lips loose so that they are allowed to bounce off and vibrate. Some people find it easier to use their index fingers to kind of push here and therefore they find a better shape in their mouth to be aided to do the lip trill. Play around and see what works best for you. We are moving towards, we are moving, we are moving, we are a planet and we are moving. Let's inhale together and with our exhalation, we're just going to allow the lips to vibrate. Ready? Inhale. Very good. Let's move to the next step, which is to add the voice. So it sounds like this. This is one of the best warm-up exercises. You want to try it together? Let's do it. Inhale together. good. We are going to add a very subtle movement of the tongue inside the mouth going from bottom to top and back to bottom. We are experimenting at this point so you can freely move the tongue so that the tip touches the upper palate or allow the tongue to just fall relaxed to the bottom. Let's try this together. Inhale with me. <laughs> it might give you a little bit of a buzz at the base of your nose. So touch your nose just to relieve it from this itch. It sounds like this. Let's work together now on another exercise which imitates the sound of the bees. Zoop. So the exercise is actually called bee zoop. We are going to sound our bees. Stay on the zzz sound and finish it off. Bee zoop. It sounds like this. Bees. Zoop. Okay. Let's go together. Inhale. Biz. 
work the most on your consonant z. This is where we sound the most. Not so much on the e or the u, but more on the z sound. Let's go together. Let's inhale. Biz. Very good. One more time together. Inhale. Biz. Now I've totally eliminated the e sound. I go from the b to the z right away. Biz. Biz. Try it with me. Biz. Biz. Let's try the exercise together. Inhale. Bzzz. Very well. So my lips in the beginning are forming E sound, therefore I have this smile, and in the end it should form a U sound. So I'm creating this tunnel like shape with my mouth. Be aware of this interval between the E and the U, which is actually our Z consonant. Let's try it one more time. Inhale together. Bzzz. One more time, bring your awareness to the zzz sound in the middle. Inhale. Bzzz. And let's try it one more time, even slower. Inhale with me. <laughs> now let's move to another exercise using ng sound. So this, if you want to picture it, is like an NGA sound. Nga. Try it with me. Nga. My awareness is a lot on the ng this nasal sound, the first letter N. Ng. So what happens to your tongue when you are saying N? Can you try and see where does your tongue land when you are sounding N? It's on the top, right behind our front teeth, and perhaps a little bit more to the back on the top palate, right? Try to say name, name, right? So in the same sense, I'm going to focus on my tongue being at the top palate, just behind my front teeth. Ng and transition into the G sound, G, G. Try the g sound with me a couple of times. G, g, g. You can see that the source of the vibration of the g sound is somewhere here. So g is even further back than the n. Yeah, the n is like right here. The g sound is more like here in the back. Let's try to put the g sound into a note. So it will sound like this. Try with me. Inhale. Well done. We are going to add ne after nga. So it will sound like this. Let's try it together. Remember to always keep your attention to the N. I can have a note using a consonant, not just a vowel. So I'm dedicating more time to the n sound than to the a or the e. Let's try to add another nga, making this a three-step 
phrase consisting of nga, ne, nga, keeping the same note. Inhale with me. Nga, ne, nga. Okay, let's try it one more time together. Inhale with me. Nga, ne, nga. Well done. Now let's take it up a note. Nga. With me, inhale. Nga, ne, nga. another exercise. This time we are going to use the syllables hanga, then with the vowel e, henge, then with the vowel e, hingi, the vowel o, hongo, the vowel u, hungu, a, e, i, o, u, which translates in our exercise as hanga, henge, hingi, hongo, hungu. You want to try this with me just once? Hanga, henge, hingi, hongo, hungu. We are thinking of a, e, i, o, u. Let's use these five different words into one note. It sounds like this. Hanga, henge, hingi, hongo, hungu. Let's try together. Inhale. Hanga, henge, hingi, hongo, hungu. Very good. Let's try this one and then we'll start going up. Inhale. Hanga, henge, hingi, hongo, hungu. Ah. Inhale. Hanga, henge, hingi, hongo, hungu. Ah. Inhale. Hanga, henge, hingi, hongo, hungu. Ah. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. Ah. Inhale. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. Ah. Inhale together. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. Ah. One more inhale. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. Ah. Inhale. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. Ah, inhale. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. Ah, inhale. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. Ah, inhale together. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. Ah, inhale. 
ハンダヘンゲヒンギホンゴフンゴアイネロハンダヘンゲヒンギホンゴフンゴアイネロトゲラハンダヘンゲヒンギホンゴフンゴ And let's try this last line one more time together Inhale ハンダヘンゲヒンギホンゴフンゴ Can we go faster? Inhale together with me. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. Again, one more time. Inhale. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. One more time. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. And one time, let's just take it really, really slow. Like this. Hanga. Inhale. Let's go together. Hanga. Henge hingi hongo hungu. One more time. Inhale together. Hanga henge hingi hongo hungu. Thank you for joining. See you in the next lesson.